Today I want to show you how to grow some eggplants, some um, peppers, some cucumbers, some radishes, and some something else that I'm forgetting right now, but I'm going to add it in and you'll see in a second. So we're going to add about five different types of plants right in these containers. All right, so we're going to have this container and that container, all right? And right here, I built the trellis. I'm a, well, I'm going to build the trellis right in front of your face uh, so you can see how to uh, manufacture a quick, a quick um, trellis. If, you know, you don't want to buy one, you got extra wire, you can just manufacture one real quick. All right, I'm going to show you what, um, what I'm using, though, for my mix. For my mix, I use some topsoil I used some black cow and some peat moss those are the three mixes I use all right mix them up real good got them in there all right what you want to add you don't want to skip this okay all right you want to add some bone meal and some blood meal halfway mixture you know about halfway down you want to have it down there so and nice and mixed into the soil so that way when your your plant roots start getting down there they get all this phosphorus and this nitrogen from those two mixes there right and that will make your, your plant grow big and root mass and, and and plump okay I also added some organic fertilizer all right this happens to be dr. earth all right all right, so I added some of that, mixed that up in there as well, all right? So we got that going. All right, I'm busting up my plants here now. All right, so we can see, I ended up with six wires. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, we can just use some of this twine here. All right, so we want to just make some squares there just to give the, the cucumbers something to grab onto. All right, all right, if my cameraman can get a little closer here, zoom out here. All right, so I got some, I stole some cucumbers and some beets from um, Uncle Pappy's garden, but he has plenty. So, all right, so we got some cucumbers there and we got some beets there. All right, so we're gonna get the cucumbers in first. All right. You want to make sure that you saturate your soil before you start your planting, all right? So your, your soil is saturated. I'm gonna water this a little bit again um, before when I'm finished here so that way the uh, you know all the roots settle in right I should have took one from here what I'm going to do in the next day or two is I'm going to put little sticks here 
so uh, the cucumbers can grab onto before they hit the trellis. I'm gonna put four in each one. Actually, this one over here has uh, pretty good roots, right? All right, so each, each pot has four cucumbers. Oh, actually, I'm sorry, there's five. I'm going to put this one on this one over here because this one over here seems to be a little bit bigger. All right, so we got five cucumbers in the back there, and they'll be out of the way, and they'll hit the trellis, and they'll be totally out of the way of the planting. All right, we're going to go ahead, and we're going to go ahead and get an eggplant in now. All right. We're gonna go ahead and put this guy, we're gonna put him right over here. And this is a black beauty, big, big uh, fruit on it. All right, so we got our black beauty in there. Go ahead, put our pepper over here on this side. All right, this is gonna be a this is gonna be a massive a lot of plants in one small space there. But you'll see how pretty it looks when you have all these fruits jammed up there, looking all sweet. All right, um, what we got here? All right, so let's get on the other side over here. Yeah, put the pepper over here. Got our black beauty. These are the standard uh, green bell peppers. All right, let's go and squeeze in. Let me go get two tomato plants. Right here, we're gonna go ahead, let me see, some stems off of this tomato plant here. And we're gonna go ahead, take this one off too, yeah. All right, we're gonna plant them deep. Now you can plant your tomato plants deep. All right. All right, that's our tomato. What's my other one? All right. This one here is a little smaller, so should be no trouble. All right. Now, as these plants get big, right? As they get big there, we want to make sure that we take all the lower leaves off. So all we have is the stems, the stems down here, and we have a clearance, right? We have a clearance there, so all the fruit will be up here, and all the leaves will be up here, and we'll have a stem on each, on the pepper, tomatoes, and the eggplant on each side there. That way we'll make some room for the beets to grow underneath there without competing too much with those leaves that are unnecessary anyway. All right, so we got some beets here, and we're gonna go ahead and squeeze some beets. All right. 
I'm gonna go ahead and get these uh, little beats in and um, and we'll show you the progression how the, how this does over the next uh, couple of weeks all right so all right I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, so you can grow small spaces just just to show you this you know small space here that uh, you can grow other types of vegetables as eggplants peppers tomatoes and all that in small spaces too make sure that you use trellises that'll help you with um just you know conserving space all right guys y'all take care much love from the bull dr ricky y'all take care